hi guys welcome to my channel happy new year and this is a great way to start the year for you to garden with me so um, i decided to do this vlog because i'm cleaning up my garden so after the crazy december um, i decided it was so messy so dirty so many weeds had grown i had not literally been doing it for like a good month so today is the day where i finally decided let me do my garden so the first thing that i actually start off with is by um cutting the trees as you can see i've got like a, a plant a wall tree that covers the wall so here's a little bit of a close-up of how i cut it so i just normally cut the long leaves that are just growing um just to shorten them because um, so that it looks nice sometimes they also like to grow on top of the wall so the reason why i have to trim it every single time is sometimes when they grow they just overlap and they look very very ugly so this is just a nice way so yeah so i didn't cut it properly uh i will come back again and cut it properly it's just a lot of manpower Uh, so then what I actually do is um, I just remove all those branches that I've cut off from the tree and now I'm just plugging up the weeds. So I know a lot of people tend to use the spade but I just find it so much better and so much quicker for me to use my hands um, to pluck out all the weeds and all the long grass that has grown and then I just remove it. Uh, yeah. So right now I'm just trying my best to just clean up and take out all the weeds. Some of them are a little bit hard to remove so what i do is if it's very hot then that's when i'll literally take up a spade and just you know go inside the roots just to remove it so i don't know if you can see the long grass that has grown uh yeah so that's what i'm trying to get rid of in this particular section so i actually had flowers here but they died um can you see that tree i had like the tree and it was overlapping quite nicely but then i cut it um because it was just too messy and it was very dirty so i had plants here and they had good shade but they all died because the sun was very very hot um so now i'm just cutting out the weeds and i'm removing them so that it's nice and clean So I just wanted to show you guys um, a little bit of how much grass is there and how I actually plug it up. So as you can see, I just literally take my hands and just pull and pull, 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 pull up until um, it's cleared and there's less uh, grass on it. So it's quite hard. Uh, so as I don't know if you can see the, the tube. So that's our irrigation that we have to water the plants, but we don't really use it. And we've been having beautiful, beautiful rain. So I think that's another reason why the weeds grow so, so much because of the rain. So yeah, I just pull it up and that's how it looks up. And I just remove it. Um, so now we are moving on to the roses. For those that love beautiful roses, this is it. This is it. So I know I'm supposed to plug it quite nicely and just use that rose cutter to cut off the roses. But I just feel like it's going to take time. Um, I just want to just cut everything out and then let it go again and then I'll just plug it nicely. I'll actually do another video that shows you how I trim my roses after they have grown. So this is just me quickly, quickly. I'm cutting the roses. So gardening is quite a lot of work and it requires manpower. Obviously you can't do it all at the same day. 
but I try my best to do as much as I can and on that day. Uh, then I'll just continue again tomorrow because I don't think I'll cover every single thing. So now I'm moving on to the tree. I love the tree. So this tree, let me just bring it a bit closer so that you can see it. Ah, yeah. So this tree is actually those nice trees that you can shape and flowers grow on it. I, just, I don't know if you can see that one rose. So I'm just trying to trim it so that it's in the sides of the circle and it looks nice. So you guys must tell me, comment below and tell me what you think of my circle. So I'm trying my best to cut it as circularly as, as possible. So right now I'm just, uh, yeah, that is my tree. I'm done cutting it. Now I'm just going to be removing the branches that have fallen and just continuing to use to remove some of the weed. So I use my hand when I remove the weed and the grass. It just makes it quicker. It's faster, um, as I said earlier on, than a spade. So this is it. So I don't know if you can see by the side I've got small other trees that I have there that also need some trimming. Um, I'll get to that. Maybe next week because I just feel like I did quite a lot today packing out the weeds and stuff. Please do forgive me for my bending. I am cleaning the garden. So, um, can you guys see the beautiful combination of the green and the white there? So, that's a weed. Uh, it's a big, big weed. Can you see December? Hey? The way we don't do things and leave things for Jen. <laughs> uh, that's the soil. And yeah so yeah so right now i'm just gonna take a flower just to show you guys how my roses grow so continue to pop off the leaves i just like that white combination over there the white and the green it looks so so beautiful and yeah so these are also weeds i'm gonna pack them out so let me see after taking a rose how they will react as i show you my beautiful flowers and how well they grow so that is how the rose looks like it's white beautiful rose so i'm just gonna give it to precious madam and see mm, no not today so now i'm actually done so i'm i just i'm just gathering everything um together and i'm just gonna take it and put it in a refuge bag that's what I'll be doing and this is how the garden looks like I have still got a lot to do quite a lot of work to do but I think I will be finishing quite soon like cutting that tree that's overlapping from the neighbors I need to do that and um, I need to cut the wall tree as you can see it's overgrown and try my best to trim that it's even hiding the aircon so bye guys that was tired <laughs>